for the second straight season, Granville's Community College hosting the Great Lakes District Tournament in men's and women's basketball this week. And thanks to wins last night by both the Raiders teams will be participating in this district tournament. Muskegon Community College, the top seed for both men and women. Now the GRCC women are the four seed and they have won seven of the last eight games and will play the Jayhawks on Thursday at three. The Raider men are the sixth seed and will take on Ancilla Friday at one. And even though they don't have a player on the roster who played in this tourney last year or their coach, they're still excited. And for all of our guys, nobody uh, on our roster has been here before and, and played in this tournament. So I think they're really excited. Uh, I think at this time of the year, it's just, um, you know, the teams that win at, in March are the teams that just want to win. You can kind of throw talent out the window. You can kind of throw experience a little bit out the window. It's just the teams who want to get it done and want to keep playing. So uh, I think we've had the last, uh, last two weeks, we've been playing really well and uh, hopefully we can just keep that fire in our belly. Anytime you can play at home, uh, especially this, this building, um, you know, it's going to give you a boost. Um, you know, it's, it's a deep gym. It's kind of like, you know, I grew up here playing at Kentwood or playing anywhere that's got that dark background. Um, it, it can come into play, but just being at home and not having to travel lets the girls stay in a normal routine, um, and it makes it a, a much better experience, in my opinion.